From gray to colorful, with 120 large-scale murals in various districts, Lyon has become an open-air urban museum. The Fresque des Lyonnais is in the heart of the city center. The building facades are painted by the group of artists called Cité Création. Gilbert Couden was one of its founders 33 years ago. The idea behind making this fresco was to reduce what was an eyesore on the urban landscape by transforming it into something people would come to see. This was plastered with posters, notices and flyers and now people come here to explore Lyon's identity. The fresco depicts famous Lyon figures, among them the author of The Little Prince, Antoine de Saint-Exupéry, and the pioneering filmmakers, the Lumière brothers. Cité Création's artists are helping Lyon rediscover its history, not just in the center, but also in disadvantaged areas. Where high-rises now stand, roses were cultivated in the 19th century, and the latest mural, Fresse des Roses, refers to those roots. For Cité Création, location is of utmost importance. This is what the mural will look like later. Each place has a different memory, many different memories, and our work, which starts out slowly, consists of making that memory reappear. We at Cité Création aren't artists in the traditional sense of the word. We're artisans. And in our paintings, we take account of social reality, historical reality. Nowadays, Gilbert Couden rarely paints murals himself. Instead, he heads the group of artists who now have an annual turnover of one and a half million euros. The money comes from private sponsors. 80 freelance artists work worldwide for Cité Création. Each brushstroke is made according to a precise template. Still, the work is a challenge for them. We'd never have a canvas this size. We like to work outside on large surfaces. I have a small paintbrush because I'm working on fine details in this area, but up high we use large rollers and it's very physical work. The painting itself is just one part of the project. Cité Création is about consensus. These artists aren't out to shock, they want to shape things. They put a lot of effort into preparations, and they work together with dedicated residents. We never have problems while we're painting a wall because, like here, we take two years of preparation before applying a speck of paint. This preparation is about gaining people's confidence, then explaining what mural painting is, explaining how we're going to do it and how people can actually participate in decision-making and discussions. It changes our building's image. So it's good for us. And there are even people who come especially to look at it. It adds a touch of gaiety, something we don't have a lot of, because in any case we have a lot of things that are fairly negative. You have to open your heart to things that are new. I personally think it's very pleasant. Cité Création has already painted more than 470 frescoes in 12 countries. From Jerusalem to Shanghai. A 5,000 square meter surface there is the largest mural, in trompe l'oeil style. We're part of the oldest tradition in the world. Our job is one of the oldest in the world. We're sure of that. There's proof. 33,000 years ago, people were already painting in caves, in Chauvet, Lascaux, and other prehistoric caves. So it's an extremely old profession. And all the world's civilizations on the entire planet from time immemorial have painted murals. The French artists have plenty of new ideas. These days, they're not only painting on walls, they're transforming them with plants.